Hey Libra, how's it going? Let's get into your March 2024 love reading. I'm giving away two free personal readings this month, Libra. So for those of you that are new, my name is Sam and I am very grateful that you're here. By subscribing, not only do you get notifications of all the readings that I post, but you also get to take part in the monthly giveaways. This month, it's subscribing and leaving a shamrock, a shamrock emoji in the comment section. Um, of this reading. At the end of the month, I remind everyone to partic that participated to check their notifications. Two people will be randomly chosen and you will hear back from me. Then I'll announce April's give, um, giveaway. And I do feel like I'm going to do more than two readings in the month of April. I'm going on vacation at the end of March, so I kept it at two, but I feel like I'm going to offer three in the month of April. Awareness, that light bulb going off, that aha moment where you receive such clarity. Focusing on actions, thoughts, or emotions within yourself. And a crossover loved one is showing up, Libra. Messages from your crossed over loved ones. Pay attention to birds. Your crossed over loved ones are here to listen and protect you. So you are being guided by someone or by multiple crossed on loved ones that were that you were very, you know, it could be ancestors, but it also could be someone that was very close to your heart. And there is drowning emotions. Some of you are healing. Some of you are very emotional right now. But I feel a lot of growth with awareness there. All right, let's get into your reading. For my amazing lovers. Past energy around my Libra spirit in terms of love. Soulmate union. Yeah. I do feel that there was a connection. This could be even present. A connection in your life where you connected on a soul level with this person. You've been together in a past lifetime with this person. There is a bird right above them. If you can see that. Your crossed over loved one. Holy Spirit. Your divine counterparts. You felt like you had it all with this person. I really feel like they brought a very warm light into your life. And at the bottom of the deck, I feel like there's going to be an apology here, Libra. Let's see. All right, Spirit, what is the present energy that exists in Libra's life in terms of love? The spark. A brand new beginning. I really feel a lot of healing going on here. What does the future hold for Libra? And their love life. What does the future hold for Libra and their love life? I see the message already, Libra. For some of you... You're overthinking things. You're thinking about something that's happened, maybe even multiple things that have happened all day, all night, and it's time to get out of your head. It's time to allow your inner child to heal. Our inner child gets wounded. It does. It happens to everyone. Things that we dream up as a child, our partner, what our future is going to look like, when we're going to have children, when we're going to get married. But now it's time to get out of your head and allow your allow healing to happen. Let's see. It's right now I feel the energy of feeling stuck. Yeah. Time to take back control, Libra. Look at this divine feminine energy. You can't deny a soulmate type energy. You can't deny a twin flame type energy. But what you can control is how you react to it, how you respond. Yes, you feel defeated. You're going to feel heartbroken. But it's time to take back Libra control. 
I love that. You're activating your higher self through this. All right, Spirit, please clarify union and abundance for the past energy with Libra. Self-care. Libra, are you having some guilt or some doubt on the way something happened? Did you need to focus on yourself? And now you're like, you're caught up in your mind. Like, is that the one that got away? If I would have just been in this energy. No, you were exactly where you needed to be and who you needed to be with your soulmate. And there will be communication with this person. But I feel it was depleting your energy. You weren't aligning to the best version of yourself. All right, spirit. And why renewal here? Yeah. Everything happened exactly the way it was meant to. What you're feeling is exactly what you're meant to feel in this moment. It's time to purge, cleanse, and release your energy. There's a lot of cleansing rituals on YouTube. They're very simple. Some are even just five minutes long. But you're ready. You're ready for a brand new beginning. We have a lot of major arcana here. So this blessing that's coming towards you, your spirit guides that are standing right beside you, it's divinely guided towards you. They're helping you heal. Let go of any anxiety or guilt that you feel, Libra. Cross watchers, take it how it resonates. All right, spirit, what is going to be the overall outcome? Yeah, there's the communication, the message in the bottle. There is honest communication coming in. Libra, you will hear from this person. Libras have a tendency of being, we, we, we overthink things. We, we are always caught up in our mind. And sometimes if we are procrastinators because we think so much about something before actually making a decision. That's me. I, I always say to my fiance, well, what do you think? And he's like, well, this is your decision. What do you think? I'm like, no, no, no. what do you think? You know, it's like, just make a move, just make a decision. And I'm not judging because I am a Libra. I'm even Venus Libra. Rising? No. Sun Libra and Venus Libra. So, there's some stability that needed to be accomplished on your end and on your, on your person's end. But there will be communication and it will be honest communication. There, were, there might have been things that both of you just made a decision to ignore. You know, cycles that kept repeating themselves within this connection that needed to come to an end. So that you could come back stronger than before. Yeah. Time to let go of the crossroads. Time to make a decision. I love it. Queen of Wands, so we do have fire energy showing up. The star, wish fulfillment. Nine of Swords, Two of Cups, Queen of Swords, Ace of Wands. Libra, this person will return. There's no need to worry. You both view each other as a wish fulfillment. There's no getting past that. Like I said, for some of you, you're connected on a very, very deep soul level. For those of you hurting presently, your crossed over loved ones are helping you heal. Like I said, make it the month of purging and releasing, clearing up your energy to hear from this person. They are a soulmate and it is divinely guided. You made that spark in their life. No matter what energy you felt like you were in, you made that spark. You brought that warmth and that light into their life. They're finding it just as hard to move on as you are, Libra. But what you can control is taking back your control. And that brand new beginning will start. 
that breakthrough you will receive. We have the Ace of Cups and the Ace of Wands. What action is this person going to take towards Libra? What action is that this person going to take towards Libra? Yep. Two people coming together, leaving the BS in the past, knowing exactly what you want, and coming together very mentally grounded. I love it. All right. Let's see. Spirit for my Libras. What else do you have for my Libras? Wish granted. Boom. You can't deny something so intense. You may hear from them through social media or an email. You may have met them online. But do pay attention. They might even be making posts or, you know, connect trying to get your attention through social media. Yeah, it was time for both of you to separate and do some soul work. For some of you, you might even went through a spiritual awakening. Let me see what they have to say to you, Libra. A message from this person to Libra. Thank you, Spirit. You've helped me feel things I never knew I could. I took the easy way out, and I just didn't know what I wanted in my life. See, they were at a crossroads just as much as you were. Your light is guiding me home. I love it. And best, I will take action soon. Please believe me, Libra. All right, let me know how it resonates. Leave that shamrock emoji down below. Anytime you want me to tune into just your energy, Libra, click, um, Click on the link that's in the description box. It'll take you right over to my Etsy shop. My Etsy shop's name is Lotus444. Multiple variety of readings over there that you can check out. Um, and I will be back for many more readings. Love and light.